Uh, um, what is up? Welcome to, uh, 34, part 34, just continuing exploring this mine. I don't remember exactly where I left off, or where I planned on going, I just remember being here. Uh, fuck. Nah, I think I'll leave the iron bee. Nothing. Oh. So I'm near an underwater ravine. Good to know. Good to know. Honestly, I don't know what's down here. I'm sure if I go down to where that is and look up, I'll know where it, where it is, but I don't think I want to do that, so... Huh. Shit. Well, only one simple other solution. Perfect. I think, in all honesty, I've explored all I can. There is still, like, iron and stuff I'd like, but I'm more here for gold, because I can easily get a lot of iron. And I already have a shit ton of coal. And lapis. I'm also here for that. Was here. Uh, the reason I'm saying was is because... I found, like, a extra cave somewhere. Another cave somewhere. And I was gonna go explore it, because I found a lava pit by the cave. How did I end up back here? Oh, did I go this way? Yeah, there's nothing down there, so yeah, I did. There's nothing down there, that means I went down there and then broke the torch. Uh, the only problem being- oh, never mind. I was gonna say the only problem being I don't know how to get to this cave. I don't want to go up here- never mind, I want to go up here. You know, sometimes I'm really stupid. Sometimes I forget this is Minecraft and I can do that instead of building stairs. Okay, I just have to remember my way back. I'll place triple torch there. And then every time I see that, I'll be like, well, what the fuck? Why is that like that? Aha! The infamous whatever the fuck you want to call that. Let's see, what's over here? Sorry, I uh, didn't realize I accidentally needed. Uh, I need to go back. Like, back, back. Not just, like, slightly go back. Uh... I'm stupid. I literally placed cobblestone here so that I'd remember it was this way, and then I immediately forgot. What 
I need to do is I need to find water. No, no water. Okay. Sorry, uh, like I said, I'm going to, um, huh. Yes, here it is. I'm going to, uh, head back, like, back, back, way back to my base and grab a bucket or my bucket of water if I have one. I don't particularly remember if I do I'm gonna head back so that I can get rid of those cobwebs so I can con continue exploring and then I'm also gonna drop off a lot of stuff just in case or just so that in case I do die I don't lose a ton of stuff but uh what I had to do first sorry I, I don't I had to talk at a lower volume because someone was outside my room. Someone I don't want knowing that I do YouTube. Uh, anyway. I feel like there's a lot of loot I can get from this mineshaft, so that's why I'm working on it. And fully exploring it, and then I might stop to move to a different mine, or make a new strip mine. Well, once I get everything and explore it as much as I possibly can, which, <laughs> let me tell you, is a lot, uh... Here, let's put, uh, do I put my gunpowder in here? I do, okay. I'll keep the string, I guess. The saddles can go in here. More to my collection. The books can go in here with the other books. This can go in my base. Uh, this can turn into bone meal, because I don't need bones. I need bone meal for crops and shit. Uh, do I put my slime balls in here? I do. Okay, and then... This should be done cooking, so I'll just keep it in my inventory, and then I'll put this here so it starts cooking. Uh, and then let me get rid of this because I don't want it, and then this because I don't want it. And then you can go in here. Is this full? No. Okay, well now it is. There we go, perfect. Um, for now, I'll put anything that I'm gonna take to my house here, and then I'll come back for them, obviously. Let me also move this stuff over here. There. That's a little better. Alright, now I can head back. I probably should have kept some coal, but I wasn't down there to, uh, cook anything. I only planned on cooking items in case I needed them at the time but i don't think there's i don't know why i say cook smelt uh all right well now i have to head back so i know this is faster but i kind of don't want to do it this way because it drains a lot of hunger easily i wonder if i've missed any diamonds so far We're good. Not gonna be spamming it anymore. Eat one of these. Uh, 
<clears throat> so if I remember, it was this way, and then I blocked those off, so it's this way, blocked that off, this way, hello little goober, then block that off, continue, see the thing, know where I need to go, and head this way. Alright, good, 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 good. Uh, I didn't, oh, that's probably why. Well, I'm stupid because I can just do that. Boom, problem solved. <coughs> I actually need to place it like that. There we go. <coughs> oh my god, sorry, keep coughing. Hello, you. I'll leave you. You can live. You are of no use, therefore you shall live. Uh, I don't think I want to explore over here. Yeah, no. Nothing of interest over here, so I will... Never mind. I will lock it off. Block it off as in I'll see the cobblestone and know, oh, hey, not exploring over there. Am I going to explore up here, but I'm going to explore down here first because there's things down here that I f would like to look at such as this which is i didn't grab it i have to literally go all the way back because i forgot to grab the fucking thing how amazing but it's fun wait did i come from this way yes wait yeah i did okay now i have to head all the way back to grab my shit because I completely forgot. The little whole reason I was going there was to grab a fucking water bucket, and I immediately forgot. Now, I don't technically need to grab one, I just need to make a bucket. It's just a thing of, I don't know if there's any water. Is there water here? Who knows? There might be, there might be. I might be able to save myself the trip, I just don't know if it's worth it. Worth looking, I should say. Fuck it, I don't say anything. I do know where some water is, because I think I ran into a water cave. I'm just not going to do anything about that, because I don't really care. I'm just going to head all the way back. This was going to start off with me finish exploring, like finishing exploring the place, but uh, not anymore. Not anymore. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to sleep after this. There's definitely gonna be a shit ton of phantoms. Which is gonna be annoying, because I hate phantoms. But it's fine, I'll deal with it. Nah, I'm not even gonna close it. I don't know why it's, like, wired into my brain that I have to close it. Like, I don't. The only reason I do... I mean, hell, I don't need this anymore. I just have it because it looks nice. I don't need this shit anymore. Like, genuinely, I just straight up don't. Because I literally, I put a fucking thing over the god. I put a trapdoor over the lava pit, so now none of my mobs can die. I still just, for some reason, don't want to get rid of it. I mean, there's no point getting rid of it. It looks nice with it. I'm just taking a lot of risk, or not taking a lot of risk, and taking a lot of precaution when it comes to that, for the main reason of, anything can happen, there's so many like tiny little things that could happen in Minecraft, oh, I went the wrong way, I'm supposed to go this way, and I think this way, no, this is the wrong way. See, this is why I block shit off. Blocking shit off is good. Wait, no, hold on. Let me just block this off with cobblestone. There. And then we'll block this off, so I remember not to go that way ever again. And then this I'll... Actually, I don't have to block that off, I'll know. It's pretty obvious, like, it's a dead end. Obviously, that's not the way to go. Alright. 
and it's yes we there's still a lot to explore like i said so that's what i'm doing it's just a problem of uh i needed a water bucket because there's cobwebs so i need to uh i need fucking uh this shit so that uh, cobwebs don't become a problem. Release me! Yeah, there's so many fucking. Oh my god. I didn't place that. That's natural. There's so many goddamn layers to this place. And it's all above where diamonds spawn, so I'm not gonna find any here. Which is just amazing. It's always nice to know I'm wasting my time knowing I'm not gonna find diamonds or anything cool here. I mean, well, I do think I can find something cool here, just not anything super cool. I would pick my torches back up, but I leave them there, because if I don't, then I'll keep re-exploring it. Even though I already have been there, or have already been there. Have I been here? I have been here. I got here from somewhere else. Also, there was water here this whole time. Well, to be fair, I didn't want to look for it. Yeah, no, I've been here. I blocked off. I don't remember why I didn't explore this way. I think I saw a mob or two, and I was like, nope. Nope. Okay. Continue this way. Holy shit, how big is this place? Genuinely. I don't think I can explore this entire place without... Fucking having to. I have sticks on me, right? Okay. Let me block up all this water real quick. Then I don't think there's anything over here. Oh, well, you'll, ne you'll never believe it, but it continues. This might be the shittiest mineshaft I've ever found in my entire life. There's so little, yet so much. There's so much stuff I don't really need. And there's so much boring stuff, yet so little cool stuff that I want to stick around for. So, uh... So, uh... I highly doubt there's anything down here. Well, there might be. I don't even know where I am. I don't think I even have a way back at this point. Ooh, what I find. Wow, torches. No, I'm just kidding. I actually appreciate these torches because now I don't have to make more. And then these are beetroot seeds. I'll take them. I, won't, I probably won't ever use them, but I did plan on expanding my farms at some point. Well, not expanding, but just making more farms at some point. So, I'll use the beet roots. Alright, we're going to block off this, though, because I don't want to go this way. Oh. That was good, bro. Alright. Oh, yeah, and then there's a whole area above me. Oh. Ooh, cobblestone's over there. I need to go over there. Where? I'm lost. Where the fuck am I? Where have I been and where have I gone? Hmm. This way, obviously, I'm going to block off. Uh, I'm just going to block off this. I don't feel like that's where I need to go. I think I need to go back this way. No. Well, shit. Oh, right. I forgot you can do that. I'm stupid. We all know this. All right. Oh, so I'm under a swamp, you say. Under a swamp, you say. Mm. Shit. Uh. Hey, bro, fuck off. Fuck off, mate. Wait, bro, fuck off. Mm. You know what? How about I... Shit. Motherfucker. Go of me, fucking stupid piece of shit. We're not gonna explore that right now. We're actually gonna completely block it off. Completely. 
I'll go back there another time. I'm not in the mood to explore that right now. I mean, there's a spawner there. Most people would use it for... I don't even know what. Most people would find a use for it. Uh, I'm not going to. I'm just going to leave it. Again, there could be good loot, but I want to save that for last just because I don't feel like doing that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Holy fucking shit. We're gonna have to use the good sword. I know that bad one won't last. Shit, my only source of light, and you got rid of it. take all this string I guess I'm not gonna take that melon seeds I don't have those I'll take them golden apple I'll take this I'll also take this I guess I I'll take I don't know why there's melon seeds in a cave but there there is or in a mine shaft still you get the point like why are they there they shouldn't yet they are so why uh, I'll take this and this I don't care about anything else Alright, cool. That was life-threatening, and then it wasn't, because I lived, so... Oh, hey, and there's this area below me. Let's uh, not go there, because I've probably already been there. There's, some, there's like a cave right above me. Okay, well, I can explore here now, but do I want to? No, not really, but will I? Yes, because I'm going to destroy this. Hate, fucking hate cave spiders. Stupid bitches. Hate them. And you'll never believe it. It was all for nothing. Holy shit, never mind. Yeah, no, that was straight up for nothing. I'm just gonna do this. Alright, problem solved. Ah, uh, fuck it. I'm not gonna explore anymore. Over there. Over there anymore. Now, we go to the even worse area. Because there's more there. As in, more death there. And now I'm gonna explore it. Please leave me alone. Stay back. Yes. You think I'm stupid? Yeah, no, I'm not. You think I'm dumb? You think I won't use my own goddamn tools when I have them? Fool. And fuck you. Genuinely thought I was stupid enough to not use my goddamn water. Big brain, one could say. My brain's big, but also useless. Please leave me alone. I don't have enough cobblestone to block you off. I'm just gonna ignore you then. Uh, anything this way or that way? No. Okay, well, I'm officially out of cobblestone now, so... No. Motherfucker. I hate these stupid bitches. I hate fighting. I hate having to fight in this game. It is so miserable. Wow, nothing over here. Anything cool over here? Wow. So yeah, this is a whole waste of time, and I should just take what I have and leave. 
But will I? Mm, yes, but not yet. Bro, fucking hit! Hit it! Hit it! I swear to God, if you kill me here, you are a fucking piece of shit. Jesus Christ. Nothing pisses me off more than when I fucking spam the button and it still doesn't hit. Like, how does that... Explain to me how that makes sense. Nope. 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 I'm done. I'm fucking done. There's too much danger here. I'm not losing a shit ton of loot because this game wants to be an asshole. It wants to be garbage. So I'm fucking done. Spine shaft is a waste of time. I don't care if there's like one or two diamonds that I may have missed. It's fucking pointless. I'm not going through here anymore. I would rather be strip mining, which is more worth my goddamn time. But this, this is not worth my time. Everything I got here was worth ish, but exploring any more than I already have is not. So I'm done. I'm leaving. I will either get enough cobblestone to continue my current strip mine or leave this one to die and go somewhere else. I shouldn't abandon this one, though, because there's a lot of shit I can get. See, I need to have cobblestone and then build that way and then continue, but uh, I'm not going to do that. I don't want to go mining anymore. I mean, I need to, because I need shit, but I don't want to. So I'm just going to slowly walk back while I look at my phone. That was miserable, and I don't want to do it again. I'm going to go take everything I got, put them in the chest they need to go in, <clears throat> and then go back to base, or home, go back to my house and sleep. Uh, let's see, gold can go in here. Let me grab the gold from here. Gra grab the gold from here. I'll put the string in here, why not? Iron obviously goes in here. This can go in here. This goes in here. Spider eyes, I'm just gonna get rid of because I don't need them. I don't know where did the, what did I just put in here? Here. I don't need to keep this, but I will, so I'm gonna put it uh, in here. Same with the bone meal and this. The gold can go in here. The arrows go in here. The seeds can go in here just randomly. Oh, I do have spider eyes. Never mind. I'll keep them in there then. No, my name tags are in here. I lied. Uh, this, 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 and this. I'm taking it home. Fucker. Walk through it, goddammit. All right. Let me... Uh... Let me head back home. Too many pigs in all honesty. See, this is... I got, oh, shit, never mind. I was going to say how fucking nice it is to have a... You know, an area where there's no mob spawning, but then I forgot about these assholes. I'm not going to fight them, there's no point. Fucking hate phantoms. Literal worst addition to the game ever. Literally should have never been added. Actually, that's why they should have been added because they can be useful or they do give useful items, but they never ever should have been or never should have been made so that they spawn after not sleeping for a couple of days. Every Minecrafter goes a couple of days without sleeping. You motherfuckers. All right, first enchanted golden apple. I was gonna make a shit ton of them, but I was too lazy, so now I'm not gonna. That's also why I have all the gold, so I can make a shit ton of golden apples. But that's not happening for a while. Let me go, t uh, not toss, drop off my shield and extra sword inside my chest. And then switch into my leather armor. The reason I wear my leather armor at base is because if I die, then I'm fine with losing my shitty armor. Because, well, it's my shitty armor. 
it's not super hard to recreate because I can get infinite fucking leather. I mean, there's also infinite iron, but I feel like if you like played a Minecraft world for ten years mining for iron, actually, nah, never mind. I wonder how long it, it would actually take to mine up an entire resource in a world like this, especially in a newer world. In a newer world, the worlds feel like pretty much infinite. So I wonder what, or, yeah, no, I was about to say the right thing. I wonder how long it would take for you to do that. Do I have any leather? I do, okay. Is my anvil nearly broken? Uh, kind of. Honestly, I don't know I'm doing it this way. This is, I think, more costly than just making new shit. You know what? Yeah, no, actually, this is more costly. I'll just wait. I'm still saving up, or not saving, getting, trying to get paper and shit. But, uh, that ain't going too well, because I kind of just gave up on that. Because I still need to make that, uh, another block taller for it to be full, I think. Um. Okay, I do. Wait. You. Go in here. Alright, we're good. Uh, I wanted to see if I had black dye so I can just re-dye my outfit. And I do, so... Alright, well now what do I do? Because I don't really know what else to do. Because I don't really have anything else to do. All I really had planned for today was to go mining. I guess I could go back to working on... Getting my, uh... Cow population back up. Because, uh, you know, some random guy slaughtered all of them. I don't know who. He came out of nowhere. He hacked into my world, killed all of them except for two, and then, uh, left. I don't know where, I don't know where he went. Was, oh my fucking god. I, I hate how when I'm looking at it clearly, it doesn't fucking close sometimes. But when I'm looking, like, here, it fucking opens and closes. That doesn't make any goddamn sense. You stupid prick. Oh, whatever. I should also get into the business of carrots, because if I can constantly go mining and constantly get a shit ton of gold, I can constantly have golden carrots. Which would be useful. Alright, let me feed my cows and shit, and then I'll just... And now the population has gone up by one. Now you come here. Alright, good. I'll keep this egg. Oh, you know what's funny? I didn't get rid of my extra sword. That's fine. I don't really need to. I will probably go back to that strip mine that I made, but probably not for a while. Just because I don't feel like it, so I'm not gonna. I still love how creative my base is. I just think... I don't know, I'm thinking of how I felt at the time and why I did this, because literally at the time I was, like, just bored. And so I was bored and then spent that entire day making this base. And it's like, why am I like this? Why am I like this? Like, when I'm not bored, I do nothing. I'm useless. But when I am bored, I do actually, like, huge things. Or, like, interesting things. My life has always been like this. Even in real life. Not talking just video games, but... I don't like talking about my real life just because I don't have a real life. My literal life is the internet. My life is video games. I, n I am nothing outside of this other than a being that lives in a house and someone just so happens to care for them enough to uh, keep them alive. But don't worry, I'm working on changing my life soon. It's just been a very, very slow process because I fucked up my sleep schedule and I needed my sleep schedule to be good just to do, uh, to work on the thing I wanted to do to fix my life. But it was a problem of, I, it took me like a week plus just to fix my, uh, sleep schedule and I just fixed it. That's the problem with my, me and my sleep schedule. It's too easy to fuck it up, but too hard to fix it. Ugh. 
but then again, I am a freeloader. I have nothing to do. I don't have. You have to. Uh, another thing you have you guys have to understand about me is the reason I upload so much is because again, I literally have nowhere to go. I I don't leave my house. There's nothing to do, and I get you could say like go on a walk, but it's like the thing about me is. I don't like going on a walk to just go on a walk. I want to go on a walk to go see something or go do something. But I don't know anything I can go see or go do. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Especially where I live. If I lived, still lived in Omaha, maybe I'd go on walks because then I'd have something to do. But I don't want to go on a walk. Especially not today. Going on a walk's more of like a future... Or, not future, summer thing because... Let me let me just check my phone real quick. It is let's see, forty one. Yeah, if it's below fifty, I'm not going on a walk. Uh, I just realized, uh, I wasn't talking. Honestly, I, th I do this sometimes. I'll steal these. I will create farms. No, maybe that's what I should do. Maybe I should start farming. Eventually, here soon, I want to work on these villagers. The only thing that sucks is my original plan for them was to build an area for them inside my base. But I'm realizing now I can't do that because, uh, one, where my base is, and two, because the wall that I was going to use it for, uh, my mine is now there. But yeah, I want to work on my farms, because if you look here, got a lot of farm, you got a lot of farming room. Lots and lots of farming room. So you know what I can do? I can build some farms. The only problem being, uh, I don't know if I want to do that exactly right now. Like, what I wanted to do was expand from there, pretty much, to at least where I'm standing now, to have big farms of s shit. So if I need any food source, I can just get them. At this point, I don't want the farms for, like, farm shit. I want them for looks. The only problem being... Or another problem that there is, is I'd have to make a shit ton of fences. Because I'd have to fence them in, in a way, so that no mobs destroy them. So, hmm, I don't know. I'll, I'll at least take these potatoes back. Same with the seeds. Actually, no, I'll leave the seeds here. Actually, no, I'm going to leave the potatoes here as well. I'm going to count them as a seed. Let me think. Hmm. I mean, yeah, maybe I could. Like, I definitely could, like, make them. It's just a problem of, I would have to, f like, this would take me all day, like, the rest of my day. Probably not actually, but, like, the rest of my day I plan on recording videos for, uh, to do. Which, but also, by the way, I'm gonna be taking a short break from MGSV content and, in general, playing the game. Because I have hundreds of games and I just don't play them because I've been playing, like, one game in particular. In general, I actually should just stop playing games in total and, like, you know, fix my fucking life. But instead of fixing my life, I'm distracting myself by playing video games all day. Like, again, literally could actively be also planning on more things. Like, could actively be planning on other things I need to do to fix my life. 
And this is this here is what we call a video game addiction. When you, uh, when a degenerate who doesn't go outside, doesn't touch grass, needs to fix his life, but instead of fixing his life, he'd rather play video games and not pay attention to how poorly his life is falling apart. Which to some people who don't have super fucked up lives, me just playing games doesn't seem that weird and doesn't seem like I should call it an addiction. But it is an addiction. Because I'm not, like, there's so many things I need to do to fix my fucking life. There's so many problems I have, and I could, instead of playing video games, be working on fixing my life, exercising, and other, like, other shit, and then also working on fixing things in my house that need to be fixed, or cleaning things in my house, aka just pretty much doing chores. Like, I could be doing that, but you know what I'm doing instead? I'm playing Minecraft on the older version of the game. That's what I'm doing. What the fuck is your problem? Bitch. Well, let's be real. Who cares, guys? I'm just a random person on the internet to all of you. None of you know me personally. And it's better that way. The less people in my life, the better. Why? Because, well, I'm pathetic. I'm pathetic and I want less people caring about me. Because less people care about me, the less I have to worry about disappointing them. Because that's really all I do. Like, when I think back to all my old friends I used to have that I'm no longer friends with because we stopped talking, not because we, like, blocked each other or anything. When I think back to them, I always just think, do they ever think about me? Do they ever think about me and think I'm living well? Because I'm not living well. I may seem happy, and I am. Like, I'm not depressed or anything. It's just a problem of, I genuinely just don't like what I'm doing with my life. Like, I, it's not that I don't... It's not that I don't like living, it's that I don't like what I'm doing with my current life. All right, sorry, I was uh, arguing with someone. Well, it wasn't arguing. One of my friends drew uh, characters from Half-Life 2. I think the drawings are good. I just think it would be better if they did color, like a color drawing. Otherwise, they kind of did like a with just pencil. And again, like I said, I think it's good. It's just a thing of if it had color, it'd be way better. You see, should I? You know what? Fuck it. I'll work on my tree. I'll work on my farms, I should say. This... I'm not going to work on. Let me make a iron hoe real quick. Let me move this. Actually, let me just put this in here. Because I'm not going to use it. I'll keep the sword, obviously, because the sword's useful. Let me just move these here. Alright. Uh, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. What was I going to do? I was going to grab my iron. That's what I was going to do. I swear, sometimes I have the best memory, and then other times I have the little worst memory. 
I don't get why it just happens. Actually, no, I do know why it happens. I always have bad memory when my mind's distracted by something else that I... Um, I just made a pickaxe. I am genuinely stupid. My mind is too distracted by something else that... I don't know. What I'm just trying to say is my mind's distracted by another thought or thinking about me thinking about something else. So now because of that, I'm not going to... Let me do the beetroot. Beetroot and potato. Those are freaking easy. My mind's distracted by something else that is bothering me rather than focusing on what I am doing currently. Honestly, I'm going to be real with you. My life only sucks because of the people I know. Not actually, but... If certain other people weren't such, like, super pieces of shit, I haven't realized this, but when I put actual thought behind it, I realize that some of the people I talk to genuinely are probably part of the reason why I can't do anything in my life. Why I can't change. And you're probably thinking, why remove them? Well, because I don't want to talk, I like, I like talking to people, I like not being lonely. But if I stop talking to these people, which are, some of these people are the only people I talk to all day. Except for one of them, because... They hate me and I hate them. They hate me for pretty much no reason and I hate them because they hate me. That's the best way to explain it. Now let me grab my carrots. But then again, that's just how siblings be. These. Alright, I want like a carrot potato farm. Or a carrot potato beetroot farm. Uh, but actually I'm going to do the melon farm first. And then let me also grab a shit ton of wood and make a shit ton of fences. I'm gonna need at least a stick. How the fuck? Stop spawning there. You too. Hey. Hey. Hey, you. Stop spawning there. Bitch ass. Alright, let's go grab my wood. I want my, uh. I want my melon farm to be exactly like this one. I want it to be exactly like this, because melons grow in the exact same way, except I want it more like right here. So I have to figure out the diameters I'm going to need. The space I'm going to need for that. I mean, it's pretty easy. I just have to do... I just have to count a couple blocks. How wide it needs to be. Three blocks. And how long it needs to be. Like, vertically. Let me also grab... This. And then I'll grab... Actually, no. I just need this. And then let me put the egg here for now. Alright. Let me see... Oh, right. Hold on. I also said I was going to make a shit ton of fence. Uh, I'm going to start working on the uh, pumpkin farm. Where's also my uh, bone meal? Alright, here it is. Alright, uh, how long has it been? 47 minutes. Alright, uh, wait. Hold on. What was I going to grab again? I don't know why I looked there for my wood. Here it is. Alright, let me make the fences and shit. There we go, do this, do... I hate this motherfucker. Also, I just want to mention, I hate this one motherfucker. I've been thinking about this recently. He wonders why we hate him, yet he's done nothing for us to not hate him. He wonders why we constantly make fun of him and say, like, he can't get bitches or anything like that, and then gets mad at us when we say that. When you guys have to understand, we literally want this man to stop talking to us, kind of, in a way. Like, we literally care so little for this man, and he wonders why, as if he hasn't been such a prick to all of us. Like, to me and my other friend, like, my good friend I've been friends with for a while. He's been such a prick to us, and yet, when we don't show him kindness or anything, he is shocked. You guys have to understand, this guy gets enjoyment out of being the most pathetic, annoying, just unlikable human being ever. Let me tell you a story he did, uh, earlier. Actually, no, I'll talk about it in the next episode. That's it for, uh... This is it for part 34. I'll see you in part 35. Bye.